I'm doing today's video Han style. Solo. Get it? Because I'm by myself. <laughs> What's up guys, Mego here. Today I want to do a video about something that I am totally passionate about, and that subject is cosplay. So let's talk about what cosplay is. Costume? Playing. So pretty much you dress up in costumes, and you have fun. You dress up in costumes, you have a good time, you make new friends, you learn different skill sets. It's pretty much the coolest thing ever. So I've been making my own costumes for a really long time, but not so much in the cosplay aspect, but more in the Halloween aspect. Because I didn't, I didn't know what cosplay was. Sorry. I love being able to put together a costume and become that character for a day or for a week or for a photo shoot, for anything. You can be a superhero when it comes to cosplaying. Making your own costume takes a lot of work. Um, a lot of drive, a lot of dedication. I walked into my first convention and I was floored at the amount of talent that I saw and it's really easy to get intimidated when you're looking at so many costumes that some people take months or years to create. But the cool thing about intimidation is it gives you an opportunity to learn more and advance more and increase your skill sets. And I love being able to walk up to a cosplayer and I like, can I feel this armor? What did you make it out of? Um, can I smell it? <laughs> yeah, that's creepy. And just learning how to do new things every day, like I'm constantly trying to pick up new materials and like, how can I make this work? How can I turn this into this? One of the cool things about cosplay is you're pretty much turning nothing into something. And that something is something awesome. You're creating a character for you. You are being a comic book character, or a movie character, a villain, a superhero, an elf, a wizard, an M&M. &M. Like, you can do anything that you want to because cosplay really has no limit or no boundary. Um, the only restrictions that apply are at a convention or in a public place that doesn't allow fun, I don't know. Um, but obviously, you know, conventions have rules. Um, you don't want to, you know, be naked. Well, maybe you want to be naked, but I'm pretty sure that that's illegal and I should stop talking about being naked now because... <laughs> Okay, moving on. Cosplay knows no gender, it knows no race, it knows no ethnicity, it knows no weight, shape, size, height, it knows no age. You know, there's always going to be an internet troll or, you know, the keyboard warriors. You can't be Storm because you're white. Or you can't be Captain America because you're not muscular. You can't be She-Hulk because you're four feet tall. All of those things are so negative. You could be a purple alien from outer space that lives on wheels of cheese for all I care. Because cosplaying is about portrayal. Portraying a character. And portrayal? That is subjective. And I get, you know, everyone's gonna have an opinion, everybody um, has an expectation, but you know, you don't have to meet anybody's expectation in this type of environment because the expectation is all yours and you can be anybody that you want to be and that's that's the beauty of cosplaying you know sometimes I'll see a character and I'm like I don't really you know fit that description but I can make it work for me but there's also some costumes where I'm like I wouldn't really feel comfortable in that type of an outfit but I could make it for me because I love that character you can be high-end Halloween, you can be low-end Halloween, you can buy your costume from someone else, you can trade costumes with someone else, you can make it from scratch, you know, DIY, you can buy things and alter them into different colors or whatever it is that you need it to become. There are so many ways to do it, there is absolutely no wrong way to cosplay. That rhymed! Thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions or comments regarding cosplay, leave them in the comment section below, and um, I'll definitely have a conversation with you. We'll get the dis this discussion ruling. And um, you guys have a marvelous day. And don't forget, there's a hero in all of us. Who quoted that? Aunt May. High five.
I love Hydra. <laughs>